and imagine going years without any answers about what led to your loved one's death. It is a hard reality, and that's why Metro Police are putting a spotlight on a cold case that's left one family without closure for eight years. Tony Sloan joins us live now. And Tony, it's been a long time, but police say they are committed to finding out what happened to James Lytle. Yeah, that's right, Amy. It's a case that's hard to forget for a lot of people who frequent the area of Pebble Creek Drive and Edge O Lake Drive. Now, it's now been eight years since the driver saw James Little on the side of the road there and called police. Now, take a look at this picture. This is him. Now, when officers arrived, he was found dead from being stabbed in the neck. He was 53 years old and found near a wood line and a pile of brush. Now, at the time, investigators believed that Lytle was killed somewhere else and his body was dumped where it was found by officers. Now, detectives later found his car abandoned nearby at an apartment complex on Sailboat Drive. But Lytle last lived on Dickerson Pike. So there's a lot of moving parts and questions in this investigation that has seemingly not gotten any traction since 2016. Now, police say anyone who has information about this case, they can call Crime Stoppers anonymously at 615-74-CRIME. If your tip leads to an arrest, you can get a cash reward of up to $5,000. But yeah, like you said, the family of James Lytle hoping to get some answers in this investigation.